function injector tester. This tester can drive common solenoid and piezo injectors such as Bosch, Denso, Delphi, Cummins, Caterpillar, Siemens, etc. And it has dual channels and can drive two injectors at the same time. Specific functions include resistance and inductance measurement of solenoid injectors, resistance and capacitance measurement of piezo injectors, dynamic stroke measurement of solenoid injectors, dynamic stroke measurement of piezo injectors, CON for dual solenoid valve injector test, Siemens piezo injector air gap measurement, injector insulation resistance test, etc. It can also control the counting solenoid valve. Each working condition parameter can be set, and the drive parameters can be adjusted according to the actual situation, which is convenient for maintenance personnel to judge and repair the working status of the injector and the different working conditions. 5-pin plug connects to piezo injector. 4-pin plug connects to solenoid injector. 3-pin plug connects to counting switch. Power cord, voltage range AC 110 to 240 volts. One resistance calibration method. Use for pin cable to connect the tester and the injector, short circuit the clip. Enter the main menu, long press the ADJ knob to enter the setting interface, and select 5 LC account resistance calibration. Short press the ADJ knob to enter the submenu, long press the ADJ knob to return to the main menu. Two resistance and inductance measurement of solenoid injector, solenoid valve. Use for pin cable to connect the tester to the injector to be tested. Enter the main menu, select the injector type, set the relevant parameters, press the start, stop button, start driving the injector, and measure the resistance and inductance. The driving waveform is the same as the original. R1, resistance of CH1 injector. L1, inductance of CH1 injector. R2, resistance of CH2 injector, L2, inductance of CH2 injector. 3, resistance and capacitance measurement of piezo injector solenoid valve. Use 5 pin cable to connect the tester and tester. Enter the main menu, select the injector type. Here piezo underscore S represents Siemens piezo injector. Piezo underscore B represents Bosch piezo injector. After setting the relevant parameters, press the start. Stop button to start driving the injector and measure the resistance and capacitance. A1, resistance of CH1 injector. C1, capacitance of CH1 injector. A2, resistance of CH2 injector. C2, capacitance of CH2 injector. For resistance and inductance measurement of Bosch crane for injector solenoid valve. Use for pin cable to connect the tester and crane for special plug. Then connect the crane for injector to be tested. When connecting the four core plug of the injector, please pay attention to the connection sequence of CH1 and CH2 with picture. Enter the main menu, press the mode button, and select the two core Lion J test mode. Select crane for the injector type. After setting the relevant parameters, press the start, stop button to start driving the injector and measure the resistance and inductance. 5. Dynamic Stroke Test of Bosch 110 Injector First, install the micrometer and the measuring base of Bosch 110. Use for pin cable to connect the tester, and only use CH1 to connect the Bosch 110 injector to be tested. Enter the main menu, press the mode button, select the test mode, and select Bosch 110 injector type. After setting the relevant parameters, press the start, stop button to start driving the injector for dynamic stroke test. 6. Dynamic stroke test of Bosch 120 injector. First, install the micrometer and the measuring base of Bosch 1 to 0. Use for pin cable to connect the tester, and only use CH1 to connect the Bosch 1 to 0 injector to be tested. Enter the main menu, press the mode button, select the test mode, and select Bosch 120 injector type. After setting the relevant parameters, press the start, 
Stop button to start driving the injector for dynamic stroke test. Seven dot dynamic stroke test of Cummins M11 injector. First, remove the solenoid valve of M11 and install the measuring gauge seat and micrometer of on the removed Cummins M11 solenoid valve. Use for pin cable to connect the tester and only use CH1 to connect the Cummins M11 solenoid valve to be tested. Enter the main menu, press the mod button, select the test mod, and select CAD underscore H injector type. After setting the relevant parameters, press the start, stop button to start driving the injector for dynamic stroke test. 8. Dot dynamic stroke test of Siemens piezo injector solenoid valve. First, Remove the solenoid valve of the Siemens piezo injector and install the measuring gauge seat and micrometer of on the removed Siemens piezo solenoid valve. Use 5 pin cable to connect the tester and only use CH1 to connect the Siemens piezo solenoid valve to be tested. Enter the main menu, press the mode button, select piezo valve opening mode. The voltage value can be set as needed. Press the start, stop button to start driving the injector for a dynamic stroke test. Nine dot dynamic stroke test of Caterpillar C9 injector. First, remove the screws on the top of the Caterpillar C9 injector, install the Caterpillar C9 measuring base, and then install the 120 base and micrometer. Use for pin cable to connect the tester, and only use CH1 to connect the Caterpillar C9 injector to be tested. Enter the main menu, press the mode button, select the test mode, and select CAD underscore H injector type. After setting the relevant parameters, press the start, stop button to start driving the injector for dynamic stroke test. 10. Siemens piezo injector air gap measurement. First, Connect the pipe to the injector to be tested and the air gap tester. Use 5 pin cable to connect the tester and only use CH1 to connect the Siemens piezo injector to be tested. Enter main menu, press the mode button, select the piezo valve opening mode. Open the air gap of the air compressor. Set the air pressure to zero for MPA. Press the start, stop button, adjust the voltage value, and measure the air gap of the Siemens piezo injector. 11. Dot high voltage insulation resistance test of injector. Use for pin cable to connect the tester and the injector. Enter the test domain menu, press the mode button, select the insulation test mode. Adjust the voltage to 120 volts. Press the STLT stop button to test the injector insulation resistance. Use 5 pin cable to connect the tester and the injector. Adjust the voltage to 170V. Press the STLT stop button to test the injector insulation resistance. 12 counting function description. Use a 3-pin cable to connect the tester and the solenoid valve. Enter the main menu, press the start, stop button to drive in the injector, and then press the count button to start, stop counting.